right, it is time. We played enough of Brett's story. We're gonna switch on over to Becky. Let's give Becky some loving. You arrive at Snowbird Mountain with your best friends, Brett, Erica, and Kiki. Objective, meet your friends. We're finally here, Snowbird Mountain. This place is awesome. Dating, drama, and debauchery. How hard are we gonna rock this place? We're gonna rock this mountain so hard. Eh, uh, I don't think so. You wanna rock my mountains, don't you? <laughs> You're such a loser. You wanna rock my mountains, don't you? What? I, um, uh, no, I mean, I don't know, I... So you looking forward to skiing? I know I am, especially with my best friend. Who's your best friend? Is he cute? Does being your best friend mean I get... Wait, what? Does being your best friend mean I get to get it on with all your friends? What? Yo, okay, so Brett's story is more grounded. Becky is... I can't... Becky's fucking crazy. Like, she's crazy. She's crazy. Who's your best friend? Is he cute? You, you idiot. We know each other since we were five. It's so weird when you think about it. It's not weird. It's not all that weird that we've known each other for so long. I love you so much, I just want to punch you in your face. It's pretty weird that we never hooked up. Thanks for coming to the mountain with me. I love you so much that I just want to punch you in the face. Um, I... I don't know. Come on, Brett. Are you my friend or not? <laughs> I'm just joking. Fine, I guess I'll take my aggression out on myself by slamming my head into the wall. Yeah, Becky's fucking crazy. But that's how it is, right? It's always a really, really good, like, attractive ones. Right? That has everything and you, you and then like you end up knowing them and they're fucking crazy. Like they go to sleep with like a whole a whole assembly of kitchen knives in their bed. Come on, Brad, are you my friend or not? I'm your friend. Just don't do it too hard. And only once, okay? Sweet. Bam! <laughs> ah, oh god, that hurt. You weren't supposed to do it that hard. Did that hurt? No, no. Um, I'm alright. Here's another one. <laughs> Wait! Oh my god, my face. Please stop the pain, please. Don't worry, I'm done. You say you were only gonna do it once. Wow, I don't know how your ex-boyfriend got, Sean got off so easy when you caught him cheating. If I were him, I'd be checking my, myself into the witness relocation program right about now. Now, can you imagine this, bro? Like, you can see that Becky's character gets away with a lot of shit, right? And Brett still is in love with her, right? <laughs> Bro. <laughs> it's okay. Good riddance. If I ever see him again, I'm going to cut his legs off. Well, that's why I came here, to get away from all of that. If I ever see him again, I'm going to cut his legs off. His legs? Don't you mean his... Hey, Becky. Hey, Brett. Did you know that girls that read books are much more knowledgeable in the ways of intimacy? I read a different volume of the encyclopedia every day. Bye. Why does Erica always act so weird around me? I think she's scared of your manly life jacket. I think she has a crush on you. Can I punch you? <laughs> she's a freak. <laughs> Can I punch you? Yo, Becky is fucking, she's, she's crazy. I think she's scared of your manly life jacket. Shut up, jerky. You're joking, right? I mean, it is kind of manly, isn't it? It sure is. Not really. Well, it's practical. Just in case there's a flood. On the mountain? Right. Hey guys. Hey Brett. Um, hey Kiki. I should probably go check in. Talk to y'all later. Bye Bex. Brett is so all about me. <clears throat> yeah, he's all about you. All about running away from you. Yeah, he's probably just nervous. Kiki, how come we don't make out anymore? <laughs> How's it going, Kiki? Kiki, how come we don't make out anymore? What? Remember those sleepovers we used to have? I, uh, I, we, um... I'm totally messing with you. Oh my god, Becky, why are you always doing that to me? It's like you totally take joy in torturing me. You're so sadistic. Which is why you're my best friend. And why we're gonna conquer this mountain together, one boy at a time. That is... Disgusting. I don't know. Look, Beckertons, I know Sean hurt you, bad and all, 
Like the best defense is a good offense. You have no idea what you're talking about, do you? Not usually, but this time I actually do. You need to get back in the game, player. By the time I'm done, they'll rename this mountain after me. What, Whole Bird Mountain? You think? That would be awesome. Wait, that could never really happen. And don't worry. You have plenty of time to pursue your modeling career while we're here. There's this guy, Elliot. That's a modeling scout. You could probably get a gig from him or something. Whoa, I lost track of time. I gotta hit the slopes so I can find some nice gentlemen to hit my slopes. Get it? Yes. Do you really get it? Yes. Are you sure you get it? Yes. I'm not sure you get it. I get it, Kiki. Yeah. That, that. <laughs> Becky is crazy. Fine, no need to shout. Get out of here, Kiki. We'll meet up later and check the prospects at the club. Later. Hey, Becky. Kiki scares me. Me too. Remember that time she stole your boyfriend? <laughs> Remember that time you peed yourself? Maybe. I know, I know. It was a long time ago. I'm just not sure you can completely trust her. Which is another thing. While you're on the mountain in between dating and working, you're gonna have to be mindful of all your friendships. Not just your old friends like me, Brett, and Kiki, but any new ones you make while you're here. People get pretty crazy in places like this, so you may have to do some meditation and relationship fixing. And that's not even counting any enemies you might make along the way. But don't worry, I got your back. Oh wow, Erica's fucking sweet. Erica's a sweetie. Thanks for your advice, Erica. You got my back. All right, way back. Wow, that's so strange. You're actually shutting up long enough for me to get a word in. Thanks for your advice, Erica. That's what I'm good at. I'm certainly not good at dating. Don't worry, we'll find somebody for you. There's other things you're good at. Don't worry, we'll find somebody for you. Really? By the time we'll leave this spot, I promise you'll have gone at at least one day. Becky, you're my BFF. Best friend forever. Thank you. You're my BFF. I thought that... I thought that... I, I don't understand. Like, the whole best friends, close friends, good friends thing. I, I, I don't get it. Can you have multiple best friends? Then how would they be your best friend? Thank you. You're my BFF. That reminds me. I have something for you. You have received the best friends forever necklace. It should come in handy later on. Thanks, Erica. No problem. Anyway, I guess we better get going. There's a lot to do. Good luck. Oh, hey, Becky. I almost forgot. Hey, Brad. Damn. When Erica takes off them glasses, though? Um, hey, Erica. See, so that's my thing, right? Is that, like, every everybody likes other characters in this game. Right? I like Erica when she takes off her glasses. When Erica takes off her glasses, mm, she goes from a C tier to a fucking S tier. Becky, I got this for you, just in case. You have received the pepper spray. Use it wisely. People get pretty pissed when you do. Just ask the bellhop. Brett, you're so practical. Yeah? Brett, I got a copy of War and Peace. Gotta go. Aw. He doesn't think he can get away easily, does he? Anyway, good luck on the mountain, Becky. I'm sure you'll do fine. Just remember, every word you speak counts, so watch what you say. <laughs> Does that include saying Erica peed herself on the way here? Oh, how do you solve a problem like Becky? So yeah, that's the thing, right? Like, Brett is the fucking man to every girl but Becky. Right? Like, that gotta suck, bro. 